Hello, I didn't see you there. My name is Leslie Chukwoma Oswala. I am an actor and comedian here in New York City, and my father loves this show. And what better way to honor my father than by introducing the one and only Dr. Njakari Damaji. Welcome to the show. My name is Dr. Damaji. We are coming to you from the greatest city in the world. New York City! Yes, yes, yes. New York City is so great. It's great. That aliens uh -huh. landed in New York City. Alien? At the end of last, week, last year. Hey. No, it happened. It happened. I'm sure that it made front page news wherever in the world you are. Wow. Did you, did you see yes, that? Yes, I saw it. Amazing. Amazing. Hey. On the same night when uh -huh. the aliens arrived, hey. the sky over New York City turned blue. Blue? What? Boom. Is it not red? Blue. Blue. Look at it. Look at it now. Wow. Trust, trust the US government. Uh -huh. In the morning, they told us that the blue sky happened because um, uh, a transformer exploded. A transformer? <laughs> what transformer? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, right. As if we have never seen a transformer explode. Yes. Have you not in your neighborhood? Maybe have you not seen it? it? Have you not seen it in your neighborhood? Uh, so many times. Did your sky turn blue? No. My point. Exactly my point. You see, that's what I'm talking about. The site, the site where the so-called transformer uh -huh. exploded. Yes. Has been sealed off. Mm. They don't want us to see what's happening in there. Wow. I'm sure that if you go there, you see the footsteps mm. of okay. uh, foot, the footprints of the aliens. Hey. You see, but they sealed the place. They you sealed know, off. you know, you know. It took days before we started noticing that people, some people in New York City, uh -huh. disappeared. Wow. We're missing. missing. Hey. We're missing. You know, people like Tupac. Uh, Notorious B.I.G. Uh -huh. Majek Fashek uh -huh. And so many others wow. They are no longer in New York City <laughs> Those aliens apparently Abducted these missing people wow. that's, that's what I think that happened uh -huh. You know, that, that was it I know. The story is still being told In hush, hush, hush tones mm. The government of, um, of The United States does not want people To start panicking wow. and start Living in New York City mm. Already the population of New York City is going down. going down They don't want people to start moving away Really? <laughs> you see, see, this is how conspiracy theories are made. Mm. This is how they are made. When something out of the ordinary yes. happens, and um, we find something out of the ordinary to explain it, Aha. that's it. That's that's it's how it happens. Because because ordinary things are not enough. Mm. Ordinary explanations are not enough to explain these things. Exactly. Oh, Jibril, my Jibril, yeah. Jibril, my oh, Jibril. Yeah. Those who make good career in uh -huh. conspiracy theory uh -huh. are often those who fail in prophecies. Yes, in Sasha! Twitter! Twitter! Ah! You see, you see, there have been so many prophecies this new year. Uh -huh. Like this one. Take a look. And when your son looks at you and says, Mama, look, you won, bullies don't win. And no. I said, Baby, they don't. Because we're going to go in there we're going to impeach the mother. <laughs> Woman is a Pakistani American. Hey. Now I understand why Trump said that he will consider banning Muslims from coming to America. <laughs> no, 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 no. You have to, you have to think about oh. it logically. You know, beyond the fact that it's Trump that said it. Think about mm. it. You know, mm. if everybody in the world will start using potty language, foul yes. language, yes, like Americans, then mm. we are finished. Mm. We are finished. Humanities will go to the dogs. Exactly. That's not good for us. That's not good for the world. Imagine, imagine, uh, um, Jehovah's Witness knock on your door, and before you open the door, they'll say, "Will you freaking open this?" That's, <laughs> that's that's the the end time we are talking about. Mm. That's what Trump is trying to prevent. I know, I know. <laughs> anyway, trust Trump. Uh -huh. The moment he heard that this group of uh, brand new congresswomen that they were coming to Washington, D.C. to impeach him. He came up with a unique reason why he should not be impeached. Mm. No, no, no. Tr take a look. Well, you can't impeach somebody that's doing a great job. That's the way I view it. I've probably done more in the first two years than any president, any administration in the history of our country. Wow! <laughs> hey! Ah. Now, for those who do not know, Presidents are not impeached for doing a bad job. They are not. No, otherwise, Buhari, Museveni, 
Ali Bongo uh -huh. and Code, they must have been impeached. Uh, exactly. If that is the condition. No. Brother, prisons are impeached for breaking the law. Mm. You know what I mean? Exactly. <laughs> I swear, I swear. Ten years from now, when this um, American nightmare... Sorry, what, what, I, I, what's I wrong with that? No, no. I mean, America's unfinished symphony. Hey. When it's over, we may be told that, truly, beside his hair, mm -hmm. <laughs> that there are some things missing upstairs. <laughs> That, you know what? Stop, stop. It will happen, you know. Hey, Ten years after, you? they will tell us, oh, you know, you know what happened? That time he was talking about the war, that there's something that was wrong. <laughs> In this new year, we are going to hear more about the U.S. president, Donald yes. Trump. You know? Yes. The Democrats, they've taken over the House of Representatives. Wow. Oh, yeah. It is a new ball game. It's a new ball game. And, and it's not going to be business as usual. No, no. Not we will be all over the case. Yes. Why? I will explain to you. Because we, Africans, mm -hmm. we need to watch and see how to hold elected officials accountable. Yeah, exactly. You, we, that's what we lack like in Africa. We need to do we that. Just, we, just, we just think we can just praise them and they will do well. Still, still on prophecies. So many pastors have released their 2019 prophecies. Did your pastor release one? No. Their followers are already promoting these pronouncements yes. without reviewing last year's uh, prophecies mm. to see the percentage of the prophecies that are true or false. false. They didn't do that. They just they keep forwarding it to me. You know? Now, now, <laughs> have you ever wondered why pastors make predictions at the beginning of the year? Have you ever wondered? I don't. You don't know? This Ghanaian <laughs> brother broke it down. Watch. The major question people ask is, why does he do it? And I think one, some of his prophecies are actually true. Two, to prove that he is powerful. And three, to gain attention for himself and his church. Because he knows whatever he's saying is being recorded. And whatever he is saying is either going to excite or make people angry. And when that happens, people are bound to talk about it. Wow! Yep, yep. It is not about passing across a message from God. That's not the reason why they do that. Mm -hmm. It is about their bottom line. Yes. And uh, about impressing the, the, the those that use bottom power. <laughs> like this one. Yes. Sasha, why are you putting this picture? Oh, this is old now. Uh, We've moved Sasha? on. We've moved on. You know? We moved on. Anyway. <laughs> so, so, Pastor Owusu Bempa. Bempa. Pastor Owusu, Owusu Bempa. Founder of the Glorious Word and Power Ministry in Ghana. Uh, uh -huh. you, know, you know the man? Yes. Released I his 2019 prophecies. Mm. I tell you, I tell you, there was nothing glorious in his words. What? They were full of doom. Doom. Full of death. Mm. For this former president and the other former president. For this former big man and this current big man. Uh -huh. Watch. 2019. Ghana for. X. President to be an ex first lady yeah. from the same house, from the same party. 2019, spirit of death, I will come on. Wow! <laughs> hey, this man he, said, he said that the former president of Ghana, 80 year old uh, Kufo, and his, his wife will die. What? They will die? Now, 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 he puts an escape clause. They always do that. He made sure that he said that people that he saw in his prophecies, they are dead. Mm. That they should pray so that they will not die. But if it happens, it must be because they did not pray hard enough. Hey. They did not pray hard for, enough. For what the president? If it happens because they did not pray hard enough. Oh. <laughs> if you think about it, you mm -hmm. know, the same thing can be said about everybody alive today. Okay. You know what I mean? Yes, I know. If you die, it's because you didn't pray hard. If you don't yeah, die, it's because you it's because you prayed hard. You know, that's it. He did not stop there. Watch. Wait, I come at NDC. My who or can be for me? Ah, only this are a cool one. And I'm who send a slap for a dinner cheap. Oh, you know, put a bow. His son is out. Yeah, me who you are, say a movie. At your mom, who are quite a baby. And oh, we are then cross over the arrow. No, ever one lead and one. Oh, lead you woman. He said that former president Mahama is also going to die. <laughs> no, you think that is the end? No, no. Watch, watch the man. Sagana man penny, Senakuma, Ebura, a solid dance, you know. 
na ampa ofri na kuma mutu mu ana mo wa no me ne pre se asori dan no se de etibi on ti obi obesi e de ahyenyame ani mo nyamo a e be ya den so obi ana wo mu obi betumi afasa papa no sabre ni wow again here he's saying that if the current president does not build a cathedral mm. nana if he doesn't build a cathedral national cathedral he will die ah. <laughs> nana that is um that is a prophet of doom there's nothing else to say about because, this man you know but okay. the but the man ran out of luck when he said this listen now that also i saw Ghanaians wearing um a, a, a funeral cloth but me who said a cream of way but i saw that it was um, an islamic funeral but uh, Ghana for you know, yeah. but it was a national thing but i heard Allah. the voices of people crying Allah <laughs> oh, yo. what i know i know i know i know <laughs> when when he predicted that a hundred year old imam mm. chief imam of yes. ghana that the man would die it did not go down well with some people in ghana <laughs> it did not go down they attacked his church to stop the death of a hundred year old man wow watch <laughs> Africa, 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 African people who did this to us. Who did this to us? Who? You we know? Inflicted it on ourselves. Listen to this man. If a pastor says that a hundred year old man will die, is that prophecy? <laughs> Truly, let's, let's be honest. Wow. No, no, no. I want you to think. Think about it. A hundred year old man, you are fine. You see, you see, the last prophecy that we got from Prophet T.B. Joshua uh -huh. was his prediction that Hillary Clinton would defeat Donald J. Trump yes, yes. in the 2016 election. Yes. You remember that? And it did come to truth. After that did not happen. You know what Prophet T.B. Joshua did? He went and deleted it from his Facebook, uh -huh. from his social media, uh, from Emmanuel TV. TV. You can't find it anymore. <laughs> and I guess, I guess God was so mad with him that God stopped revealing uh, prophecies to him. Yeah, he stopped it. Nothing. The great prophets cannot prophesy anything great. anymore. Finish. Thank God that we have the great apostle. Yeah. You know, great prophet is out of the commission, but the great apostle, Apostle Suleiman. Apostle Suleiman! Oh, he's, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's, he's powerful. He released 50 prophecies this huh. year. 50. He decided to speak for all those uh, penis shy, you know, the ones shy pa pastors like uh, Prophet E.B. Joshua, uh -huh. Bishop Oedebo, uh -huh. uh, Enoch Adebo, uh -huh. who have retired from the business of proclaiming prophecies. Hey! Now they are just collecting tithes and selling books and holy water mm. and magic pencils Mag for students to take jam and wire. No, did you, did you, did you use that? Myself. Of course, once you just mark it, tell you go to C, C, <laughs> go to A. No one anyway, Apostle Suleiman's prophecies covered everything mm. from fire outbreak in Canada, uh -huh. he went that far, to Donald Trump you losing the second time election. You yeah. I, I know, I know. He saw 2019 election in Nigeria mm. as rigged 100%. Hey. And he saw an Igbo man as president in Nigeria in 2023. Oh, yeah? To show that he reads the newspapers, Apostle Suleiman said mm. that he saw. Key stone bank hmm. needing prayers. PDP allegations. <laughs> <laughs> he also said, this one surprised me, that Dr. Damages Dr. is going to marry Kosi or Jack. Oh, no, I mean, I, 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 I don't know they see me now. You know, this is wonderful. This is wonderful. By the way, Kosi, what would ever happen to Kosi? I don't see her. She's she, dancing on Instagram. She's still she's dancing. dancing yeah. She's still uh, she's doing she's her thing. And people are still following yeah. her. Yeah. Oh, this is amazing. Really is is she going to call me anytime? Soon? I don't know. <laughs> you have and, to ask her. Anyway, anyway, <laughs> back, back to the great apostle. 50 prophecies, uh -huh. yet none of which was Dino Melaye hey, collapsing again he, he during the shooting of his blockbuster Hollywood, no, what am I saying? Nollywood movie, hey. Finding Dino Part 2. Hey. 
finding of Lilo part two. The mat one first. Yes, I'll take it. Take, 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 take. Now, for those who have forgotten the beginning of this movie, uh -huh. here is a reminder. It started with an invitation from the police as far back as July 23rd to Senator Malaye over a case of criminal conspiracy and attempted culpable homicide. Wow! <laughs> you know, I mean, drama. Yeah, no, 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 look at it. This is, these are serious charges against this man. You know what I mean? I know. I serious know. issues. Serious ones. You know? <laughs> now, now, watch, watch the actor doing his thing, and tell me if he does not deserve an Oscar nomination at least. Yes. At least a nomination, not if you don't get him to win the main actor of the year. Watch him. Maybe by the time the the robber see the season na 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 movie star. You see, my only concern with Dino's acting is that he is um, distracting us exactly. from the big show from the real issue. that is coming up on February 16th. Hey! I'm talking about Nigeria's presidential election. Yes, yes, yes. It is shaping up to be the most important election in our lifetime. Mm. I mean, our lifetime, yes. Now, the only purpose of the 2019 election uh -huh. is to determine who will be the president of Nigeria uh -huh. in 2023. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that amazing? I know. That is what is at stake. Mm, exactly. Everything else has been settled. You know what I mean? Uh, yes. It has been settled. What? What? It's been settled. What? That one is been settled. Here's Nigeria's oh, Minister of oh, Transportation, Mr. Roti Miyamichi, oh, explaining why oh, President oh, Buhari oh, is the person to vote for. Watch. The president is not listening to anybody. He doesn't care. Let me, he can write anything he wants to write. The president doesn't care. Does he need? Wow! <laughs> what? what did he just say? <laughs> you see, you see, most people don't know this. Did you hear Amechi say, you can write it if you want to? Write it down! You can write it down he if you want care. to. He doesn't care. He said that Buhari does not listen to anybody. He doesn't. And he does not read anything. He doesn't. To which I say, Amechi, Amechi, get out of here, man. Yeah, yeah, Go and sit down. No, Tell us something we don't know. Stop telling us all what things we know. Tell us, for instance, if the actor in Asu Rock, what did he name the kind of call that guy again? Jubri from Sudan. Amechi, tell us if Jubri from Sudan, if he's going to appear uh, in the presidential debate, uh, the jo what is it? January 19th. Uh, present yeah, is he yeah. going to appear? And how much is he going to be paid for the gig? Because because it's an acting gig now. Yes. He just, just told him, you know, you play this role. Like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's watch our match again. This country will change, I swear. <laughs> but you know what? This country will change. This country is killed. This country is going nowhere. I swear. <laughs> not even, you know, no, I'm not joking. Oh, I'm Echi, my I'm Echi, eh? I can see that um, his bipolar is back. You know? ah! when, was, when was the last time you took your medication, Amechi? When was I the last time? You, you know, you know. In another of his um, moments of self-reflection, our resident madman uh -huh. wrote to me, Amechi. Wrote to me, Amechi. Again, he's saying the truth. He's saying the truth. You know. Remember, remember that long time ago, Amechi, the same Amechi, yes. said that they, the Nigerian politicians, uh -huh. still. They steal money because we, the Nigerian citizens, have refused to stun them. And when you say, okay, exactly. play the thing now. You have stoned nobody. That's why we are stealing. You, you see? Wow. You see, you see, if Nigerians know what is good for them, uh -huh. they should listen to the likes of Amechi. Exactly. Especially when their illness is uh, in full swing. <laughs> like when there is full moon, you know? <laughs> because so that's when they speak the truth. I know, I know. I know. Amechi's handlers are all over social media yeah. saying that uh, Reno, Reno Mokori, you know, uh, and the PDP, the doctor the They were the devil doctor. <laughs> what that means is that for Amechi to do damage control, 
he has to release the whole thing. Exactly. Let's hear it now. Give of, us the of course, don't wait for them give to do. Don't wait for him to do that. Okay, people write it down all about that. <laughs> don't wait for him. You know, I know Amechi's handlers. They know that their man has a big mouth. Mm. Here are Amechi's handlers trying to stop my crack reporters. Long time ago, when he was state governor, from recording where Amechi was running his mouth. Uh, it's a private conversation now. You recording no, no, it's it's you, is, it, is it me kneeling down? Are you working for the government? Yes. Oh, okay. It's a private conversation. Oh, is that what? It's a private. 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 Okay, then I'll tell him to stop the conversation. You can tell him. Yeah. And I was just It is true. Wow. Amazing. And, and, it did not take time before they started demanding an apology from Show, right? I know. For for calling them psychophants. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Look at look at them. That's why that's, that's my governor too. That's 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 he's he's my governor too. So we can ask questions. Question. Can, question. question. can you imagine? It's like in New York. Can you imagine? Apologize to who? For calling me psychophants? No. Because you are not. You can say you are not. No, no, no. Don't stop me. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. I'm a professional. No, no, no. Show my bar. Let me bar. See, see, see. All over social media. I hear people say that election 2019 is already rigged. Yes. Just like Apostle Suleiman predicted. Mm. You know, no. The people who are saying this, they are also pointing at Buhari keeping the IG of police, IG of police yes. from leaving office. Yeah, because yeah, the man is the man is old the, enough to leave office, to retire. Old, yes. But Buhari is keeping him. Keeping they are also pointing at Buhari promoting uh, Amina Za. Yeah, that, Amina Zakari. Zakari. Yes. His relation by marriage. Yes. As Ainek woman in charge of um She's from Bombay. Putting putting gas in the standby generator. Yes, yes. And um, making <laughs> sure making sure there's water at Ainek office on the election day. Hey! Can you imagine that? Doctor! No, hey! no, no, this is I'm, 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 com I'm confused. I'm confused. Could Amina be related to Buhari? And Jibreel at the same time. Yeah, I don't know. That, that, I, I don't. Confused. I don't get it. This, these are the things that people talk, and I get confused. You know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, anyway, the real president in Wetin, <laughs> Abu Bakr Tiku, yes, is sending his vice presidential candidate, Mazi Peter, to, you know, to the United States of America mm. to consult Nigerians in America. Yes, yes. Now, now, when I say president in waiting, uh -huh. some people misunderstand me. Mm. I mean president in waiting, as in waiting for the FBI, the FBI? to give him the green light <laughs> that he <laughs> could now FBI, come to. FBI is waiting for him. <laughs> he could now come to America, or waiting no, for them, no. or waiting for them to say, uh, "Can we have you turn your back?" <laughs> Now, well, in a well, statement, well, well, well. <laughs> in a statement issued by Atiku from his uh, Dubai office, is that uh, where his office is? Now they're not really looking at I, I don't know where his so office Nigeria is. Not for them he now. said that because of logistic reasons, mm -hmm. he could not come to America. Wow. Hey, yeah. He hey, could not yeah. come himself. So hey, yeah. he promised that he will come to America and see Americans, Nigerians mm -hmm. in America, after he's sworn in as president. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That's, that's, are you not happy about that? We're happy. He will come. He will come. Now, what do you think about it? What do you think about it? I don't know. If there are no challenges, you don't need to come. And you are you come in because you know that there are challenges. And then giving us excuse that you have many challenges, that's why you haven't achieved results. And then you still want to go. First lesson I learned in my military uh, training is never reinforce failure. What we have now is failure. Never you reinforce failure. Um, Papa, Papa, Baba Yabo, I didn't ask you now. I didn't ask you. I'm talking to real Nigerians yes. who had no hand mm. in the election of uh, all these uh, failures. Yes. You know what I mean? Since 1999. Baba, Baba Yabo, don't think we have not noticed that since 2007, every four years, you raise the hand of somebody and say, vote for him. Vote for him. And we will vote for him. You know? Yeradua. You did that. Yes. Jonathan, you raised his hand. Yes. Buhari, you raised his hand. Yes. All of them failed. Fail, fail. And you are doing it again in 2019. You want to bring that articulated. Eh? It's following your choice again, not reinforcing failure. It's a doom. I'm asking you, Buhari, I'm a passenger. It's doom. I'm asking you, passenger. Yes. Since the passenger left office in 2007, he yes. has endorsed all the failures that came after him. Exactly. He wants to do it again with article. Should we let him? Should we let him? Now, oh. if, if we follow him again, the fault is not his, yes. but ours. Uh, it's ours. Meanwhile, 
Fadambaka, do you know oh, Fadambaka? Fadambaka has gone ahead to endorse Buhari for president. He did. He did. He said, this, this, look at the headline now. The man of God said, I quote, if God doesn't want Buhari, he could have died. Mm. If. Are you telling me? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes. Is Fadambaka phone line to God now disconnected? <laughs> no, no, because, because now he's just guessing like the rest of us. If God doesn't want, if. By the way, by the way, someone who is not guessing yes, I at all is Buba Galadima. Buba Galadima! Here is what he I had to say uh -huh. about Buhari and uh -huh. integrity. Mm -hmm. Watch. To go to Kaduna, today they are multi billionaires They have assets all over the world. In the, they have estates all over the world. I can show anybody that wants to know. So the issue of integrity with this government is not, is not an issue for... Go to Daura GRA. All the houses that are looking like... You, you go there, you see like you are in Dubai, or you are in London, or you are in Beirut, are built by who? To whom those properties belong. So please, I don't want anybody, any FEC man, to talk to me about integrity. Please, this should be the last time anybody that is engaging me in debate will talk about integrity. I will take them to the marketplace. Wow! So, uh, so politics has... You see, you see, Buba don't vex. You know, look at the man don't vex. He, has, he, has vex. he said he go open book for them. He go open book for them. And this is my book. question. Why is he wasting time talking? Should... Let him open the book. Let book. him do that. Okay, okay. Give us names now. Give us. Bank account. Mention on it. Buildings, address. You know, let's, let's get them. Not just talking blah blah, you open open the book. Now that will be the next level, the real next level. You know what I mean? Yes. When the books are opened. Nonsense. No. Here I Hi, I'm Dr. Damages. Do high fees damage your wallet? When you send money home, I've got the damage control. Use Wave for no fee transfers. Remember the promo code Doctor for five dollars. <laughs>
You see, these are the kind of these are the kind of things that shock the head of our leaders, so-called leaders, yes. elder statement. They called you, sir. You remember Bill Clinton used to call Abacha when he called Abacha. He said, "Sir, sir. Abacha, Abacha was impressed." Abacha said, "The man called me, sir." The next thing they gave Abacha tea, or they gave no, 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 Abacha. They gave Abacha. Um, in next thing they they brought the two prostitutes and uh, <laughs> say, "Eat this one too, sir, this sir, one, sir, sir. Take this take one." This one sir. He, he didn't come back. <laughs> Nonsense. Nonsense. Oh, 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 this, this is good. 2019, I challenge you challenge. to report me to EFCC. What? Atiku tells Buhari and others. Oh, yeah. People who are saying he's corrupt, he's challenging you to report him to EFCC. Let's open book for that. You see, you see, is it not double jeopardy? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yes. Already, he has a case with the U.S. Justice Department. Exactly. Do you have to report him again? To, you know, that would be trial I after know. trial. Yes. Let him just come and settle the one. <laughs> Just buy the ticket to the US. Come and settle the one here. Just we are we okay. We're okay. We're okay. Forget about forget you. about the EFCC. EFCC, no. They forget about. Just come and settle the one here. Just travel to the US and forget about 2019. Nonsense. Nonsense. Oh, oh, I bring one for you every time. This is this one is for you. Eleven thousand one hundred Nigerian women uh -huh. landed in Sicily, Sicily as Italy. prostitutes in 2016. What? What's the staggering the, the, number? The, the economists of London. What? You know, you know, 100 years from now, mm. Sicily will have their own the video and whiskey yes. singing the Afrobeat. Yeah. I mean, I mean, we are just waiting. Wait and see now. What? People don't think about the positive side to this. Sicily they will retire from thinking. they will retire from prostitution and then they will have the video, the kids, you know. They will. Sicily, Sicily. <laughs> yeah, there will be the video of the next 100 years. Things, mm. you know. <laughs> right? From Nigeria. You remember that then. People will think, how did that happen? Woo. Okay. We have Michael Jackson from Italy. Woo. It's from this Bini Bini. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for your email. It's time for your email. Wow. Doctor, my doctor. Yeah, happy I'm back. New Year. What, 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 happy New Year, doctor. What happened to Agege Bread? What Agege Bread. To Agege Bread. What happened to, to everybody? They, 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 you know, they are still in the New Year mood. You know, they, they are not back. They, they are not back yet. They are still, they are still vacating. What is? Ah, ah, they, who, you know, doctor. They, they, they want to. My vote patients for you. are They want to now. vote for you. Then they went back home. <laughs> my now. patients ah, are. My patients they are. They went sick. back home. Okay. Okay. So, so do you have emails? Do yes. Have emails every day, doctor. Okay. Let's hear them. Uh, so, um, our first email is from David. 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 Uh, it must be in Lagos. Okay. David. No, David from Lagos. Aha! Yes, David from Lagos. Friend. He's my friend, yes. David from Lagos. Uh -huh. What does he want? He writes, Yes. Dear doctor and the crew, Wow. Nice. I've never missed an episode of your show since Good day man. one. I discovered it in the late 2016. Good man. No. Please advise the youth in Nigeria uh -huh. to change their mentality towards elections. That's a good point. I watched a video clip mm. where Nigerians were randomly asked, mm. who will they vote for mm. in the next election? Yeah. Few went for Shore, and majority went for Buari and Atiku. Not because they actually like them, mm. but because they, they're under the dominant parties. Hey. Some said they don't want to vote any party aside PDP or APC Ooh. in order not to waste their votes. They, uh, online, waste their votes. What? Hence, I, I can tell that most Nigerians are afraid of the truth. We cannot go anywhere if we continue this way. I for me, mm. I will vote for Shore Omoyele, wow. even if it is only me that I'm standing. Oh, my friend, my friend David, thank you very much for writing. This is the attitude. Mm. When I say that the outcome of the election is settled, mm. it's because the people who choose who should be the leader of the country yes. have given up. They've already given up yeah, exactly. the power that they have to determine who should govern them. Mm -hmm. They said, oh, we can't know. You can't win this. Oh, she cannot win. No, <laughs> I, know, nah. I know, I know, I know. What if all of you said, we are going to vote for her? Yes. She will win. Do your part. I will vote for him. He will win. Yes. You have the power. Yes. Yeah, you make me tired. Yes. Next. Okay. So our second email yes. is from Ismail in Saudi Arabia. Wow. He writes, yes. I, doctor, mm -hmm. I am Ismail. Yeah. Salam and you, I'm a graduate scholarship student in Saudi Arabia doing software engineering. Wow, smart guy. I can't help but feel bad about the situation at home. It's terrible. I never wish my kids grow up in such an environment, hey. Nigeria, hey. as I did. Wow. 
I wish to go back home one day to mm. contribute my skills Thank you. to the development of our people. Yeah. My greatest fear starts whenever I land at the airport in Nigeria. Security of life. Uh, my question is, okay. how do we help our people mm. without getting into troubles of our society? Uh, my friend. Thank you so much for writing. This is a question everybody is asking. Mm. You know, you have to try. You mm. see, people who go back home to contribute, they have to, people have to change that society. Yes. Are we not going back? We are going, are back. going back. Thank you! Back. 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 <laughs> very soon we'll go back. Yes. You know, you know, you can, you can for now you can just give people scholarship, take care of small things, but we eventually have to go back in mass and make a change. Yes, exactly. There's no other way. There's no, no other, other way. No the other reason way. why things are that way is because they know that people who are decent, mm. they run away. They run away. So you leave the riffraff mm -hmm. to, to run the country. Exactly. And what do you expect? You know, the doctor, you that takes me back to my famous mm. quote. If the West refuse to rule, mm. they will suffer the rules of the idiots. Wow. Yes. Wow. Amazing. Yes. yes. Did you write that? that? <laughs> I've, been, I've been practicing this for a long time. Next. Yes, that's our last that's email, it. Doctor. Uh, it's just two emails we That's have all the time we have for emails. Uh, please keep sending your emails to Dr. Damages at gmail.com and follow us on Twitter at Dr. Damages and on Instagram at Dr. Damages. Now, here's my concern for today. Yes. It's taken from page 419 yes. of the book, Anonymous. Anonymous. By no, Anonymous. No, who wrote it? <laughs> Anonymous. <laughs> and it says, be there for others, mm -hmm. but never leave yourself behind. Wow. Be there for be others, be but there never for leave others, yourself. But behind. never leave yourself. But what happened to a lantern? You know, a lantern that sees everywhere, but it doesn't see with somebody. <laughs> That's, you don't want to be that. Be there for others, but mm -hmm. never leave yourself behind. Oh, you know, I go you are, deep. I go deep to find this. Are you leaving yourself behind? No, I, that's no, my new resolution. Not to leave, leave myself behind. behind. When I buy puff puff, I give you one. I take one. But you, were, I give you one. I, I book of it. Until next week, I'm Doctor Damages. I diagnose you. You yourself. <laughs> See, so what, what's going on? What's going on here? But you're leaving it behind, doctor. How? I yeah, give yeah, you pop up. You want, you want, you want to pop up that you want to. I cannot upgrade it. You know? Are you going to swap me for the train? Are you going to swap me for the train today? <laughs> Maybe. No, no, that one is. I can give you a ticket. Now. I think you graduated. I give you your own pass. Look, I told you I'm an expensive permanent, nurse. Permanent pass. I'm an expensive nurse. No, yeah. I'm not yum. And you are giving me pop give me permanent. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. Sushi. You want sushi? Yeah, it's sushi. Sushi. That's a posh food. <laughs> yeah. Sushi. Uh, give me pando yam. <laughs> no, 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 no. You, you. You need you need sushi. You need to be you know this is Trump's this country. Year, you know this what year I, mean? I want to grow my belly. Uh, you have to because you can't be a big belly. man without yes, belly. Yes, exactly. I'm, so that they'll give me plenty yeah, money. No, you can't be in the kitchen cabinet. You know what I mean? <laughs> you don't have belly. No, you can't. Anyway, see you next week. Thank you, doctor. All right, man. See you.